Tamara mm -hmm. actually mm -hmm. told me, she's like, Adrian, you are not making the wrong decision. They're still keeping it real. While it's been three years since Adrienne Houghton and Tamara Mowry Housley shared their conversations on daytime TV. I never really got to say goodbye. I never, I never got a proper kind of exit because of the pandemic. They're still having important chats off screen, with Adrienne revealing it was her former co-host who gave her the push to quit her latest gig hosting a TV show. She's like, Adrian, you are not making the wrong decision. You will never regret putting your family first. It allows me to be a full-time mom and it allows me to really fulfill my greatest dream and give 100% of myself to that. Adrian, who shares one-year-old son, Ever James, with gospel musician, Israel Houghton, opened up about her next chapter on The Jennifer Hudson Show. We were being bi-coastal. I feel like the last time I was here, I told you we were flying back and forth between New York and LA. And my son is now walking. He's walking. Six hour flights with a walking baby. Ooh, baby. It's a different kind of situation. <laughs> and I think that for me, I wanted this baby boy so badly. And it's I really beautiful. want him to be my full focus, my main job, my, my part time and my yes. main job. Adrian moved back to New York during the pandemic. And it wasn't long after that, she and Israel welcomed their baby boy via surrogate. For a long time, I was like, I don't want to share my journey until it's something that I can bring someone hope. Mm -hmm. You know, like, I don't want to share my story unless I can tell them that there's hope at the end of, of the story. Mm -hmm. And I feel like we're there. Soon after that, she had to return to work in LA, a lifestyle that proved harder the older ever gets. He knows when I'm even leaving to work now, and I yeah. try to like be like, I'm gonna sneak so he doesn't cry. Oh, he's so gorgeous. And I'm obsessed with him, and I actually had one of my girls, Tamara, mm -hmm, actually mm -hmm. told me, she's like, Adrian, you are not making the wrong decision. You will never regret putting your family first. That is beautiful. And that gave me so much peace. Hey, they say the best advice comes from experience, and putting family first has always been Tamara's MO. I've been so grateful to have worked for so long in Hollywood, I'm now at an age right now where I can say, wait, I want to spend this much time doing this and this much time doing that. It's part of the reason the mom of two walked away from the reel two years before it ended. The choices that I'm making right now, the number one question I say is, well, am I going to have enough time with my family? Am I going to, am I, am I going to be able to, you know, be there for them when, when I, when I need it? And I feel blessed, like I said, to be in a position to be able to be able to say that. Adrian says she feels the same way and can't wait to lean into full time mommy mode. It's a new season of life. I've never not worked since I was 15 years old. And my mom was like, hey, I know you're scared, but like God is not going to punish you for this. Like you're going to no. be blessed in a different way. And so I get emo talking about it, but I'm so excited. I'm, I've never had like routine in my life and I signed yeah. us up for mommy and me classes that we start in December and I am beyond blessed and just excited. She is so maternal. Mm -hmm. She is so tuned in. He loves her the way he falls asleep on her. Like I take 20 pictures a day just of that, just of their bond. We have a feeling that number is going to go up. Cheers to all the Kodak moments ahead for Ever, Adrian, and Israel.